Alright y'all, today we're getting into the real reason and true purpose for the Ring Garland in Kakariko Village. Alright y'all, so as you make your way into Kakariko Village, you'll notice right at this little stand here that Coco is selling ring garlands. She'll tell you that she has ring garlands for sale and that they're made with a lot of love. When we ask what's a ring garland, Coco will tell you that the ring garlands were made in commemoration for the ring ruins. Because the ring ruins brought so many people to Kakariko Village, Coco thought that she'd make a ring garland to help bring people together. Wrapping up your purchase with Coco, she'll let you know that she added a little extra love. Now, when you buy one of these ring garlands, there's something very different about this item. It doesn't go into your inventory. But I'm gonna tell you guys, it's seemingly impossible to carry this ring garland where it needs to go. So we're just gonna put this ring garland right on down. And what we're gonna do is go into our inventory select a shield that has nothing fused on it and we're just gonna fuse this ring garland to our shield so go into your fuse option hit l2 to fuse it to your shield now you can carry this wherever you need to go you always have this ring garland just in case we come across a side quest where you're responsible for bringing people together now all the way from your location in kakariko village you're gonna make your way all the way to gerudo town now this is one of the things that i absolutely love about zelda tears of the kingdom we're currently in gerudo town but kakariko village is probably one of the first places you'll visit during your playthrough and for me gerudo town is actually one of the last places i decided to visit but here in gerudo town is where you'll find the true purpose for the ring garland after restoring in Gerudo Town and freeing it from the Sand Shroud, one of the first places you may want to consider visiting is the Canteen, so that Feroza can make you one of these noble pursuit drinks. Then you're going to want to visit Ashai's class, teaching Gerudo women how to interact with men. Now your job here is to basically make the ladies in the class feel comfortable around men. In the first instance, that's going to involve you putting on a mask to cover up your face. In the second instance, that's going to involve you having that drink, the Noble Pursuit from the canteen. And in the third instance, we finally find the truth behind the ring garland. Delta here says that there's no reason for her to practice in class because she's already been abandoned by love, by luck, and by happiness. But we're not going to let that happen because we traveled from so far away to deliver this ring garland that was actually created with a bit more love by Coco. After noticing the ring garland, she realizes she has not been forsaken by luck or by love. So there you have it, guys, the true purpose for the ring garland. Now, I'm uncertain if there's more side quests or additional purposes for the ring garland if you guys know any differently please share your thoughts in the comment section below i want to thank you guys so much for tuning in please consider subscribing to all city 2 for a bunch more of zelda tears of the kingdom tips tricks and walkthroughs i'll catch you guys on the next video or live stream easy y'all